Oh, it would have suck if I broke it just then. Well, that would that'd suck balls, wouldn't it? <laughs> So we're just kicking around some ideas here in the shed, wondering if we're going to have a double door opening or half a door opening or no opening, but we've got to have some opening because otherwise that wouldn't work. So we've got, we've got some piano hitches and we're going to, I think we're going to put the one that we hope to open on first and then I guess if we screw that up, we can put the opening on the other side. <laughs> so we just got to cut another board and then probably route her a little bit off the corner on it. So I reckon that's just gonna sit like that. Bloody hell, I probably should have paid more attention to woodwork school, shouldn't I? No, oh, hang on, what is the word woodwork school, you dipshit? It was called woodwork classes. I was in the metalwork class, I liked metalwork, I was quite good at that, except I used to argue with the teacher, because some of his ideas were a little bit too bloody precise for my liking. Well, I'm just thinking maybe I'll just put the one hinge, just that, this one big hinge in, just down the middle and then we might not have to dig it out because this wood's bloody got crooked anyway and one hinge would do it anyway wouldn't it? I was going to have the hinge the whole length of it but hell that'd have to be stronger than three little hinges wouldn't it? Bum -ba -dum -ba -dum -ba -dum -dum -bum -bum. We'll cut a bit of wood anyway and then we'll sort of see whether we can hook it up and if we have to route of the hole in the wood because it's not big enough bend well we'll do that won't we that won't be a big bloody problem oh well, let's do that shall we let's measure up where we're up to so 1440 if you remember was our measurement but was it 1440 on the outside or the inside of the black line now there's a puzzlement <laughs> but oh no no push be man maybe i should just stick to running around in the forest God, I never did claim to be an expert woodworker, by the way. And I never did claim to be an expert anything. Exactly. Just quietly. So we might be a little bit less. I might go on the top side of the black line just to see if we've got a bit to spare. We can always trim a bit off it, but you can't. As I said earlier, it's bloody hard to add stuff onto wood. But it's quite easy to take it off a bit more. A couple more pieces in the tray if I screw it up. <laughs> so we'll just take a half a blade length off of that for end and we'll be on the money I reckon. I'm not sure whether half a blade width is actually a measurement but anyway that's what we're going to do. I'm not sure, would that, be on the, would that be in the woodworking book? Take off half a blade length? Oh too much by a mile. Correct. Son of a bitch. Crap. That's going to be unacceptable, isn't it? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. This might have to be the next one. Slightly smaller. <laughs> oh. Hey, we'll just edit that bit out. That's what they do. That's what they do on your on your on all your other shows other than this when the lad's making fun of me. Even on those cooking shows, apparently with young Jamie Oliver, who is a bloody awesome chef, by the way, and I love his show, but apparently he has like three or four other people cooking, cooking the same meal just in case it doesn't quite look right. I think that's the go, but I don't know for sure, but that's, apparently that's the story, and I thought, well, and that would make perfectly good sense, because imagine, well, I don't know, if he's whipping up a Bernay sauce and the shit goes curdly, then he's got to wait to redo it all, and like, I don't know how much an hour you'd be paying all those camera crew and freaking whatever it is, all that crap. Probably cost a fortune. More. <laughs> Probably cost a shitload more than I do. <laughs> okay, look, that was a bit better. I was a bit more like it, Bushy. Really, eh? Let's put that back up on here, shall we? Do, 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 do. thinking about all those weird noises I make when I'm doing stuff and I was it's interesting because I'm playing this crazy game that I played a long time ago called Age of Empires and it's got all these weird noises in it and I wonder where that where I get it from Ooh, ah, when, the, when the bloody soldier bloke gets born <laughs> I don't know maybe Yeah, the 
depending on how we go for flushness as to whether we have that I think we'll be in trouble with the when we put the screws in anyway won't we do you think I think we nearly have to cut it in look at how bloody crooked our bench is <laughs> goodness me oh how crooked our book I know it's not it's not crooked at all it's just sitting on something <laughs> <laughs> this might be more saleable product than the bloody fridge. <laughs> might not. The only problem is I've actually only got four windows, so it'll be a very limited addition. Oh, it's trying to rain. Hey, hope it does. They're only talking like, I don't know, five to six mils, but hell, even if we got that much, rather than half a mil, that'd be very nice. Because I think there's some very up, un, there would be fairly tense farmers, I think, just up here at the minute. I mean, hell, it's not good. I reckon we're going to route that out of there. What do you reckon? Route that out of there? All right, we're just going to route that bit out of there. So we can sit the hinge down, I guess. <laughs> Hello. Down here a bit here. Not with the project necessarily, but with the weather. Well, I think the projects might be downhill too, but still. I just something just to clean this out because that was a very rough bit of routering. <laughs> I gotta find my jumper, it's getting bloody cold here. Where the hell would I put I'm just trying to work out how the bloody hell you screw it all together. Like that. Anyway, we'll screw this bit onto this bit. Well, actually, we'll screw it back together first. You know, I should have the father-in-law here. He can tell me how to put a piano hinge on. Oh. Hey, if you're ever at your, ever at your lovely girlfriend's house and your old father-in-law happens to be a cabinet maker, pay attention instead of snuggling in the corner. What are those on your face, Dad? They're eyes. So I can see shit. <laughs> oh dear. What's that old joke? Something about, that's about hair though, isn't it? Which I've still got some hair, so. What is it? It's only the people with a good looking head get to go bald or something or other? So maybe it's only the people with ugly shit eyes that get glasses. I don't know. But that's not fair, is it? <laughs> Oh, I think I've got lovely eyes actually, just quietly. Just having a little brag. Just trying to get this up level so we can hook this hinge on. I don't know whether that's how you meant to do it, but that's what I'm gonna do. <laughs> I'm not so sure about this piano hinge idea, I think. It probably would have been easier just to do three little hinges and figure it out so you can adjust it. We might just put a couple of screws in it and then see whether we can shut the door. If we can't shut the door, well then we'll have to do something else. That's what I was kind of thinking would work. Why would there have to be a bit of weld there on my bench that I can't just slip that up there like that? Oh, come on! A little, just a little bit of cooperation would be good. Wouldn't it? Not too much. I don't ask too much really out of this whole existence. Just a little tiny bit of cooperation. It doesn't look real promising. <laughs> <laughs> I'll just go inside and see if the wife's got a drill set. Run, little weenie, 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 weenie drill. <laughs> I found a drill that's probably a bit bigger than I thought it was going to need to be, but it's actually working. I think it's going to work, so we'll find out. This is not the recommended retail though, when you're using, well, shit, using a, <laughs> a wooden drill in a metal, in an aluminium frame, but. <laughs> That'd totally suck if we smacked the glass, wouldn't it now? <laughs> So 
So I reckon we'll do one either end and one in the middle and then we'll see if it swings. And if it doesn't swing, well, I don't know. Ta-da, ta-da, ta-da! Oh, my lordy, lordy, lordy. Help! Place your orders on the bushbee.com. There's only one other one that you could buy. We might have an little option. <laughs> I'm getting a little bit ahead of myself. I haven't even got any bees in here yet. <laughs> oh, fuck, what was that? Well, that's another bit of wood. <laughs> perfect bar it's pretty bloody good so some of my screws because I'm screwing wood screws into aluminium I'm having to play around with them a little bit but that's pretty bloody good I reckon considering considering it's a bit of repurposing I'm sure if you've got one of these snazzy ones it'll be a bit flasher but for what we're doing it's gonna be just diddly oddly so they'll go in there like that oh no no it's not gonna bloody fit <laughs> I'll suck wouldn't it after all that thinking we're all so bloody clever <laughs> Yep. And that will go like that. Look at that. That's just fucking amazing, brother. And then we'll be able to take footage of us. We'll be able to take footage of the ladies in all, they're all together. <laughs> <laughs>